Hey, Cook Hall Chef Kendra here, and today we're making potato latkes. Mmm, yummy. So let's do what we do and make it happen. We have eggs, vegetable oil, black pepper, salt, all-purpose flour, garlic, onion, and potatoes. First thing we're gonna do, guys, is peel these potatoes. I have a vegetable peeler here. I prefer this kind, and we're just gonna get them peeled. Guys, you can find this and other fine recipes at chefkendra.weebly.com. That's chefkendra.weebly.com. You know I got you. I'm gonna rinse these potatoes off. And I'm gonna put them in some water and I'm gonna set this aside. Now I have an onion here. I'm gonna cut it. Just like that. I'm gonna do the same with the potatoes. Now I cut the onions and the potatoes this way because I'm gonna toss them in my food processor to shred them. This just makes it easier to go into the food processor. Move that to the side. Have a little bowl here. And I'm gonna crack my eggs. As you can see, I have my trusty KitchenAid food processor here. We have our potatoes right over there. Our potatoes and onions. Our other ingredients is hiding back there. So we're gonna get the show on the road. We opened it up and this is what we have. Oh my gosh, it's perfect, guys. Look how wet it is. We're gonna address that in a little bit. All right, guys, I'm excited. We're gonna clean up a little bit, and I'll be right back. We've gotten it out of the food processor. Now, what you wanna do first, let's look around and see if there's any humongous chunks of whatever, onions or, or potatoes. I saw a giant piece of onion there. Food processor didn't handle that well want to get these big chunks out of there now I'd be over the sink usually for this next part we're gonna take this mixture with clean hands and we're gonna squeeze out all of the moisture you can start really soft like really light light squeeze and we really just want to squeeze all that moisture out. If you do not take the time to do this, your latkes will be soggy. Okay guys, look how much liquid came out of four potatoes and an onion. Look at that. Now all that stuff was water and it was starch also from the potatoes. Guys, so far we peeled, washed, shredded our potatoes. We shredded the onion. We crack some eggs. We have our flour, our garlic, our salt already, and we have some oil to fry these things in. Grab a fork, dump in the eggs. Start mixing the eggs in. The salt goes in, the pepper goes in. The flour goes in, and the garlic goes in. How simple is that, guys? And we're gonna mix all this together. Just wanna make sure you mix it well.
Now I'm going to set up a spot to put them when they're done. Then we're going to start frying them up. I have a fourth cup measure here. Now I'm going to scoop it up like that. Put them in the pan. Flatten them. Do about maybe two at a time. I'm gonna fry one side, and when that's nice and fried, I'm gonna get in there and fry the other side. Now we're gonna flip them. Okay guys, these are ready. Wow, look at that, they look fantastic. You know, get them over here. Not soggy. There you have it. I made a big batch and I'm serving it while it's hot. I have a little sour cream over the top, a little parsley. You can put a little chives over the top or whatever. It's all good. Joe Kitchen, do what you want. Yo, thanks for watching. Share my videos. And if you haven't already, subscribe. That's all for this time. See you next time. Jeff Kendra is out. Peace.